Wait, who is that? Hold on. Is that... The elf? No, that's one of the... I don't even know who that is. So if I say, excuse me, You're will you let me through? One. Geralt, I, I shall help you. Step back. Stop telling me what to do. Mmm, she sounds like my girl. Come on! Oh yeah, I'm gonna have... Oh, great. Great, this is going to be the fight of our life. Hold on. Got one. Got another hound. Come on. Thank you. Oh, now he wants to come through, huh? There you go. Come here! What? As if. One more. Oh, come on! I was just about to kill him! Oh, I was just about to kill him. Let me get rid of these hellhounds quickly. Because there's no way I'm gonna be stuck here forever. Especially since he's like... Come on. First of all, fire. Right here. Come on, I can't do fire damage? Come on. Come on. Yes! Dead. Are you well and whole? Yes. I see it. Unnecessarily. Let's look around. We did it. Holy cow, we did it. Okay. Let me see. Alright, let's watch this message. Sire, this place is no longer safe. Do not tarry here long. Trust no one. And above all, beware the witches of Crookback Bog. Try to reach the place where last we were together. What? That's it? Where last we were together, not much to go on. Exactly, that's so generic. Damn it. Perhaps it's best he didn't leave a clearer message. The Wild Hunt broke in here. Surely they saw the projection. You they have a, everything. You made a good point. If they had more time, they'd probably have torn the place to the ground. But that doesn't change the fact that we haven't learned anything. Not about the Elf, not about Ciri. Well, we know they were well acquainted and traveling together. Wonder why they split up. Perhaps because the Wild Hunt was on the Elf's trail, and Ciri would be safer if they did. The witches of Crookback Swamp. Crookback Bog. Kira, if you're hiding something. But I didn't say. Just tell me the truth. Give me any details. You know these witches? I've never met them, but I've read of them. In an old manuscript I found in one of the huts in the village. It mentions the village witches venturing into Crookback Bog at times to liaise between the villagers and the crones, the ladies of the wood. The crones appear to be intolerant of outsiders, but they help the local folk. Apparently, they stop the spread of the plague in Velen. Hmm. What's your take on this? I'd love to shrug it off as the nattering of so many old women, yet throughout my first fortnight in Velen, I had horrible nightmares. Oh, wow. Something was calling me out into the swamps. Maybe the witches. I decided to enter the dream consciously. Render it lucid. I confronted the thing directly. It broke contact at once. Peaceful nights ever since. 
Why didn't you say anything earlier? I told you Siri had a run-in with a witch. Well, I, I had no idea you meant them. If I told you something, you would have rushed off to find them. But we needed first to confirm that Siri was here, didn't we? She made a point. I shall tell you everything now, of course. Now? After I safely led you through the cave? I can't believe you'd think so poorly of me. Perhaps you do bear a grudge against sorceresses. Mm-hmm. Can't imagine where that comes from. How do I find them? The swamps are vast. Dangerous. But they say the crones mark the way for peasants who wish to visit them. The manuscript mentions a chapel in Crookback Bog. And from that chapel, one must follow a trail of treats. Treats? Trail of treats? They didn't read you bedtime stories at Clare Morhen. All normal folk know that witches live in gingerbread houses poised atop chicken legs. I'll have to see that to Trail of treats? That's like a diabetic nightmare. I... I truly do believe you'll find you, Cirilla. Thank you, I appreciate right, it. Then. As a start, let's look for a way out of here. Good idea. You see what I mean? You see what I mean? Even after defeating that mini boss back in the last episode. Ooh, what's this? Anyways, after we defeated the last boss on the last episode, we're still stuck here. Thing is, we're just trying to figure out how to leave. Oh, wait, what's this? Okay. Look for information about Siri using your Witcher senses. Not you, Siri. The other one. Every time I say that name, my phone keeps on acting up. It's so funny. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Is there something in here? I mean, thank you for the black pepper. It's a poem. Spiring ash down dreamy hills. Past sparkling waters, Tirnalia drifts slowly, softly, silently into oblivion. Sage lips blacken, frosted bones quiver. Before an icebound eye can blink, in distant skies I will watch your descent. Yes, I love poems! Ooh, what's this? My dear friend, I had a feeling we wouldn't have a chance to talk before Vizima, so I leave you this message. I know there's much we both wish to say, but there will come a time for that later. In any case, a letter is no place to broach topics of such importance to us both. So why I write you now? You have something waiting for you at the Royal Palace in Vizima. Consider it a gift from Emphier and myself. You can pick it up at your leisure after your audience with him. When you exit the throne room, simply follow the covered walkway in the courtyard, turning right at the corner, then take the first door on your left. You'll be inside a chamber with a fireplace. Oh. Okay, whatever. Nothing that leads any clues to the young witcher, but... What else can I find here? Wait, hold on. No, that's just... Wait. What's this? The papers! Right here! Must have burned these notes himself. The hunt wouldn't have bothered him. Meaning he knew they were looking for him. So this is it? Must have burned these notes himself. The hunt wouldn't have bothered. Meaning he knew they were looking for him. So this is not it? Kira. No. I don't know, Kira. This is not... This is not helping at all, honestly. I just... Wait! Another clue! What's this? The potion I gave him. Seems he saw a use for it. Drank it. Okay, so I found two clues so far, which is good. My witcher senses are sensing. But I have a good feeling maybe there's something here for me to take. Oh, Olive, yes, thank you. A nice little snack. As if I need one. 
Okay. Thanks for that too. This is not It's not really helping. What am I not seeing here? Wait, hold on. This. Oh, a lot of goodies. Mm, mysterious mage herbalist. And what about the other one? Mm, mysterious mage herbalist. No, nothing? How do we get this door to open? Strange. My medallion's trembling, but there's nothing here. What's with this wall? This wall is shaking. It's quivering. It's a fake wall. It's a, a Fugazi wall. It's an illusion. I sensed it as well. So I can we walk through? I might run into such things, so I bought this. What is it? What is that? Oh, what? The Eye of Nahalani. It dispels illusions. It's easy enough to build, so you're welcome to this one. Thank you. It's to come in handy. I appreciate your gift. Each time it does, you will think of me. Oh, how cute. Uh, thanks. Wow, Kira. How cute. When you notice a simmer in the air, walk towards it. When you are close, press X to dispel the illusion. Amazing. Exquisite. Yes, it is. Let's see where the passage leads. Kira, you got a light? Of course. I'll let you go first. Do you feel that? No. A flow of fresh air from the left must be an exit that way. Good. Let's get out of here. Wait, there's still the magic lamp. What? The magic what now? Lamp. The elf promised it to me in exchange for my help. And since his return here seems doubtful, I must retrieve it myself. If I can find it, that is. Will you help? You know what? Since you've been helping me this whole time... Yeah, I'll help. Splendid. Come then. Alright, Kira. The Vela Take... Glan. We're Take me to, to the lamp. Here. I can't believe I'm helping her find a magic lamp. Looks like another damned riddle to me. Again? Hold on, let me see something. I don't see any clues, so... Oh, something's shaking. Inscription here. Show me. Can you translate the inscription? I can decipher maybe a third, but that third doesn't make much sense. Give me a minute. I was never any good at the high variant of the Elder Speech. Take your time, Kira. Hmm. All right. This might seem a bit literal. I'm afraid I can't replicate its sophisticated internal rhymes. Just translate it to make sense. Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The okay. first to light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, by the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet, like the second, played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. How poetic. Hmm. Sounds like a riddle, all right. All right, let's see if we can solve this. So, we got light in the correct order? Oh, this is gonna be a pain. Okay. So this is the guy with the dog. So I assume this is the first one. Another dog, but with the the guitar. So here's what I'm gonna do. You ready? One. Lit up like a charm. Of course. We're gonna be here all day, I can tell. Uh two? Wait. Something just happened. Mm -hmm. Behind that wall, a movement. And it's right here. And this has to be the last one. Wow. 
Wow, you know, I am so proud of myself. I didn't even look up the cheat or anything. I just guessed. <sighs> Looks like some elven sanctuary. Whose grave is it? What do you think? No inscription, sadly. Hmm, sign of the gull. If I didn't already know where she was buried, I'd guess this is Laura Doran's sepulcher. Really? Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. Heroine of a tragic legend to some, but most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Kragenin of Laud. Perhaps the elven mage is Lara's kin. It would explain why he's helping Ciri. Possible. This what you're looking for? Uh -huh. Is that the magic lamp? So what's it supposed to do? Let's leave this place, shall we? Okay. I can't even... Ooh. I'm looting that. And I'm looting this. Day 3275. Final conclusions regarding the lamp. My experiences with the magic lamp on equivalent focally... Confirm that by using it, active centers of condensed spiritual energy can be coaxed into contact and can communicate a limited set of the being's last memories. Laura Doran's remains, however, emit entirely inert spiritual energy despite the violent conditions of her death, which should have strengthened the desired ten tendency? Tendency. Wow. I can't read tonight. I am so sorry. Laura remains silent. At this point, for the research on lamps enabling contact with the dead seem entirely useless for my purposes. Okay, let's leave. Come on. We already got the lamp. Let's skedaddle because at this point, I'm sick of being in this cave. We going? Hmm. Are you catching up, Kira? No, she's just taking her sweet time. Look at her. She's able to run as fast as she can, and I'm over here just bum rushing everything. The his eye. Ought to use it. There you go. There you go. No illusions in front of my salad. We're free! To freedom! Terrific. I love this. Ugh, at last. But it was worth it, right? I agree. You something about Siri in the end. Something important. Do you intend to venture into Crookback Bog? You must tell me about it afterwards. Oh, I will. Get the chance. Geralt, there are two types of men. Mm-hmm. Those who see opportunity and take advantage, and those who forge the opportunities themselves. Okay. I've always seen you as an example of the latter. Besides, I've a favor to ask you. Okay, what so, now? Visit me sometime? Of course, I got you. I'll stop by. You can be sure. In that case, I shall be waiting. See okay. you, Kira. Be safe, Kira. Thank you so much for helping. She's gone. Look at that. How sweet. Okay, so after enjoying a nice boat ride, I came across this thing. Look at this. Look at this. What is this? Oh, this is so creepy. I'm not going to lie. Cookies, right? Ugh. I bet they're all stale. You saw the maggots inside those cookies? Oh, Wind no. Solving. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. Those cookies were infested with maggots. What is this? Another one. Another one. Yeah, I'm definitely on the right path for sure. Ooh, you hear that sound? Oh, this is nasty. Yep, I see it. I am officially on the cookie trail. Look at this. 
Look at this. You know, I just realized something. I'm not the only one who's going down this path. Yeah, keep in mind, other kids have actually went through the same trail as well. But my thing is, how many have died on their way to see these nasty witches? Wow, they really... The peasants were not joking when it's when they were saying how this trail is full of cookies. Nasty, rotten, smelly cookies, man. It's giving me... Hensel and Gretel type of vibes. Now, who's gonna try and throw me in the oven? That's what I wanna know. Because Gerald, he's not the type to let anyone throw him in the oven like that. What is this? Ooh. Yay, I got money. Any other loot I can take? Nope. Let's keep going. Yeah, this is totally not scary. Horrible. Horrible. I think... I see something. A hut? A village? Oh, this is bad. It's empty. Totally empty. I don't see anyone here, though. Doug went in the kitchen, stole a hunk of meat. Cook gave him a licking, strung him by his feet. Cooked and bled him empty, stripped his skin off clean. Laughed and said, how tasty, best sausage I have seen. What kind of a song is this? Shouldn't have ate the pup. Now we're light a fire, gonna roast him up. One, two, three, the one to fetch the kindlings. Interesting rhyme. I don't know you. Go away. I mean, stranger danger, they're exercising it, as they should. I'm proud of them. What are you doing out here alone? We's not alone. We's with Grab. But Who's where did Graham? you all come from? We's orphans. All of you? There's war. So there's orphans. Didn't know that. I'm not looking for any lip from you, you parentless brat. I'm looking for the witches of Crookback Bog. You look like a witch yourself. The w w witches of the bog. We can't yeah. go in the bog. Gran don't let us. When Who my is this grand person? Missing, Gran said it was because he went in the woods and got lost. Gran cried an awful lot after that. He could still come back. A young woman got lost in the swamp. She has ashen hair and a scar on her face. You kids see anyone like that? Ain't no lassies here. What am I? You're Aww. not lassie. Lassie's got tits. Excuse me? I heard an old man say once, when the army was here, he says, hide them lassies in the woods. They's dazzling the soldiers with their tits. And it's torturing the poor lads. That's what he said. I am so sorry you had to hear that. No wonder they, they talk like that. Listen, the girl I'm looking for, she's in trouble. I understand you might not want to help me, but you could try to help her. How do you know she was here? I heard she visited the witches in the swamp. But there's no witches here. There's only frogs. And snakes. And Johnny. What's this talk? What kind of jabbering is this, eh? Are you grand? No one allowed here. Just kids. My kids. They're allowed. But who are you? Wearing swords like a bandit. Ma'am, hey, hey, hey. No trouble here. I'm just looking for my own kid. That's all. You look after these kids? They're my grandchildren. Grand's good to us. Gonna be soup with scratchings for supper. Kids get lost in the woods. I miss them. Seen them in the woods. No one has. Are you one of the witches of the swamp? I hear Crookback Bog. Witch? Me? Yes. 
Yes. Aye. I've no broom nor owl and not one wart on me nose. Got a pretty nose, see? You don't need to have all that to be a witch. Oh, you darling girl. Oh, kids are so sweet. Who's Johnny? Johnny, Johnny ate a cat. Come the more in some furry shot. Watch your language. They tells tales and tales, naught but tales. Just talking to the kids, asked them if they'd seen a young woman. Oh, it was a lovely young woman. Really? Wore a long, beautiful braid my mummy did up for me. Had dresses with flowers on them. Maybe you've seen her. Young, ashen hair. Your betrothed. Daughter, no. actually. Daughter? Mm -hmm. My dear, sweet little daughter. And her sister. Where are they now? Maybe they've come to some harm. A bit of help, please. A young, ashen-haired woman. Just need to know if you've seen her. What Come on, lady, tell me. Wash your hands, we'll go catch crickets. Won't learn anything from you. Aye, because I don't know nothing. That Johnny knows. He knows a lot. When I ask him something, he says, Wait, I'll scratch my arse and tell you. Ugly word. What you saying? To the hut. You'll stand in the corner. I'll make sure you do. Oh, yeah. he's in timeout Be now. Be gone. What? I'm just trying to find my kid, ma'am. What? Man, this is crazy. I just... I just wanted to know where she is. What's in here? Ooh. Okay, I see there's some goodies here. Wow, this place looks pretty nice. I don't know if Gran is really in charge of these kids, but she's really... really taking care of them. This is a nice place. Hold on, what's in here? Huh. There's blood marks on this rock. Blood handprint on this rock. That's a little weird, don't you think? What's in here? Yay. What about here? What's in here? Oh, I can't even open this door. Huh. You know what? Let me talk to the kids. Yeah, don't worry about it. Mm, I wish. So these kids don't want to answer. Cool. Hold on. Let me see. I don't see anything through this window. Wow. So this is where all the other kids are sleeping, huh? Oh, sorry. I'm not trying to be rude. How about this? Hold on. Gran? Wow. Is this like her personal sleeping quarters or something? Look at that. She don't need this. I'll take it. I'll take this too. Let me see. What else can I loot here? There you go. Not too bad. Wait, there's more? Oh, uh, he's really in timeout. That's hilarious. Can't come in here. Not allowed in here. I just want to talk to the boy. Not allowed. It's not allowed. He won't talk to you anyway. Gran don't like you. Why? And and Johnny's made up. And, and stranger stale kids. Just tell me where I can find Johnny. Johnny's made up. Kid. Be gone. This lady is so adamant about me not talking to this kid. Now I just gotta figure out how to separate her from that little brat so I can at least get some clues or something. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies and I'll see you next week.